The NDTV has accessed exclusive government details that reveal pro-Khalistani leader Amrit Pal's blueprint for India, from distributing guns that he sourced from Pakistan via ISI to building a private militia at drug rehabilitation centers. Neeta Sharma has all the details on this exclusive. The dossier also mentions that since the time uh, Amarjeet Singh has been arrested, or uh, rather, you know, he has come back to India, that is last year. Since then, even the drone droppings across uh, international borders, whether it's Rajasthan, whether it's Punjab or Jammu and Kashmir have increased. If I can give you just details, 33 drone sightings were done only in the month of January, that is January 2023, out of which 21 times drone has been sighted over Punjab. And most of the times these drone sightings comes come with a caseload. You know, these drones come across from uh, Pakistan. They drop their caseload. At times they go back. At times the BSF shoots them down. So obviously, uh, drone uh, sightings have increased. The weapons which are coming from uh, across the borders have also increased. Uh, agencies have markings of uh, ISI, even Chinese markings uh, when the weapons are coming from across the border. As far as uh, his uh, uh, WPD is concerned, there are clear, clear Clear linkages that it is getting its money, it's being funded by Pakistan, ISI, how Gurdwaras were being uh, used as shelters to raise his own armed uh, militia, how the de-addiction centers, you know, he used to get, he used to take out all these uh, small, small yatras every day going about 20 kilometers in a in a village trying to mobilize the youngsters uh, trying to you know gear them uh, giving them bhashan and also trying to say uh, all anti india slogering he was actually doing so he was trying to gear up uh, the dozier mentions that he was trying to turn one community against another community. So interesting details have come across. But the fact is, you know, it, it all looks like a movie wherein a hero is on a run and everything is falling in, uh, in place. But the police, you know, is chasing and is always last to arrive. Uh, if we see first, he went uh, by by Mercedes car, none the less by the Mercedes car he was traveling. And then he went by Breeza, then by a motorbike. Every time he his... Uh, Fuel ran out or even his, uh, he, he wanted new clothes. There was a man who was waiting for him to give him all kind of assistance. So it, it is obviously, it seems like, you know, the Operation Swift, which the uh, intelligence, uh, which, which the Punjab police and center had launched, as of now, it seems like it's Operation Flop.